Alright, so our 30-60-90 triangles. So if I have a 30-60-90 triangle, if I call the shorter leg the one across from the 30 degree angle, because shorter sides are across from shorter to smaller angles, if I call that angle S, or that side S, then I know that the hypotenuse is twice that, and I know that the longer leg is whatever that is times root 3. And that, I'll prove that later, maybe in a different video, but I know that they come in this ratio when I have 30, 60, 90 triangles. So if I were given a 30, 60, 90 triangle, I look at what I'm given, and I, I like to label it right away. The one across from the 30 is the S, the one across from here is 2S, and the one um, across from the 60 is S root 3. So if 4 is S, then the hypotenuse is just twice that, is 8. And the longer leg is just s times root 3, so just 4 times root 3. So we're really happy when they give us the shorter leg, because then the rest is just pretty nice. When we go on to the next one, here they give us the hypotenuse. So this is supposed to be the 2s part. And the, again, the shorter leg is the s, and the longer leg is the s root 3. So 4 equals 2s, right? If 4 equals 2s, then s must equal 2. So s is 2, and s root 3 is simply 2 root 3. So now I've solved this triangle, I have all the sides. If they give me this triangle, here they gave me the longer leg. That's kind of the, the not so nice one. That's the S root 3 part. And again, the shorter leg is just S and the longer the hypotenuse is 2S. So if S root 3 equals 4, I have to figure out what S is. I have to divide both sides by root 3, which is kind of nasty. So S is 4 divided by root 3, and some genius declared that we're not allowed to have radicals in the bottom, so fine. I'll multiply top and bottom by root 3 to rationalize it, and I'll get 4 rad 3 over 3. So if S is that, then this side here is supposed to be S, so this is 4 rad 3 over 3, and that's the short side. And the hypotenuse is just 2 times that short side, so just 8 rad 3 over 3. So that's my hypotenuse. Got all the signs. I'm good. One last problem. You see the 5 rad 3 here? That's the short leg. So that's supposed to be the S, the one across from the 30. The one across from the 60 is supposed to be S root 3, and the hypotenuse is 2x. So the 60, or sorry, so this one here should be s times root 3. So s is 5 root 3, so this thing is 5 root 3 times root 3. s times root 3. Kind of gross, but we can do it. We know that root 3 times root 3 is 3, and 3 times 5 is 15. So this side here is 15, and the hypotenuse is just twice s, so twice 5 root 3, so 10 root 3. Ugh. And that's that.